Yeah, welcome to another session of Sam's Economics Tutorials and in today's video I'm going to be explaining a change in supply and change in quantity supply. Okay, a change in supply is the complete shift of the supply curve from its origin either to the right or to the left. The shift of the supply curve to the right shows an increase in supply while uh, a shift to the left shows a decrease in supply and this change in supply is caused by factors such as uh, changes in weather conditions, changes in the cost of production, indirect taxes, subsidy, expectation of future changes in price. So let's start, uh, let's explain using this uh, graph or diagram. Let's start with uh, the first point, uh, changes in weather condition. Weather condition mostly affect the supply of uh, agricultural products. Let's assume there is a good weather condition. During good weather conditions, the, the supply of agricultural products will increase. And so this increases supply from Q0 to Q1, causing the supply curve to shift completely from SS0, from SS0 to SS1. So this shown on the graph and this complete movement is shown where the graph shifts are on the points A to B. And also, we talk of bad weather conditions. When there are bad weather conditions, this will lead to a fall in the supply of agricultural products. And this will cause the quantity uh, supply to, to fall from Q0 to Q2. And this is shown on the diagram where the supply curve shifts completely from SS0 to SS2. Uh, and this is seen on the points where the, it moves from point A to point C and also the cost of production, changes in the cost of production. A fall in the cost of production will encourage producers to produce more and, they will, and the supply will increase from Q0 to Q1 and this causes the supply curve to move completely from SS0 to SS1. And when the cost of production increases, supply will fall from Q0 to Q2 and this is shown on the diagram where the supply curve shifts completely from SS0 to SS2. This is called a decrease in supply. And let's talk of indirect taxes. Indirect taxes would increase the cost of, of uh, production and also this uh, will reduce supply from Q0 to Q2. And this is shown on the graph where the supply curve shifts completely from SS0 to SS2 at the same price. And also we have subsidies. Remember, subsidies are financial assistance given to producers. So when the government grants these uh, subsidies to producers, they will increase their supply and the supply will increase from Q0 to Q1. And this, uh, and this movement sh is shown on the graph where the supply curve shifts completely from SS0 to SS1. Let's move to change in quantity supply. Change in quantity supply is the movement along the same supply curve, which is caused by changes in price. So as a result of increase in price, this increases the quantity supply from Q0 to Q2. This movement is shown from point A to point B. Okay. Another uh, situation where price falls from P0 to P1, the quantity supplied will fall from Q0 to Q1. This obeys the law of supply, which says that supply increases as price increases and falls as price falls. And this movement is shown on the graph from point E to point C. See you in our next video.